hello today I will show you how to make a uh, create a drainage density in my previous tutorial we saw how we extracted uh, streamlines from uh, an SRTM as a digital elevation model so today I will show you how to create a uh, density marvelous drainage density from the streamlines now they are basically you know that drainage density is we know that drainage density is a sum of uh, the, the total sum of the uh, streamline length over the area that's the total area so we can get the sum the total sum of the streams by going to our attribute table and then this has shape length that's the length of the road and the stream each of them so we can just click up here <laughs> up here right click on it and go to the statistics so the sum is the total of them so you copy it copy and you come on to the attribute table of this one and then here you create another field and we'll name it dd here then you click right click on it and you come to fill calculator yeah. now on fill calculator we said some of the what drainage density is or some of the total length the total stream length which we have here this divide by the area oh we do we have the area we don't now let's calculate the area for this first add another field and uh, okay yeah call it area then we come to calculate geometry and area and square kilometer yes yeah so this is our area so we go here field calculator then we put in this divide by our area our area then we load to uh, to represent it graphically we will come to our search box and we'll search for focal statistics statistics yeah focal statistics and then our input oh so we need to bring in our flow line yeah, this raster. Yep. So, so our input raster will be the streamlines raster, and uh, since it's still gonna be raster, we'll just put it D density as our drainage density. And then here we'll use cycle under the radius of three and want to okay it. So this is our drainage density. So we can come to symbology and yeah. classify it mm, let's leave it as a class of 10 and it's okay then let's give it a color and mm, let's say this will work mm, 
don't like it push and then let's invert let's do it like this so this is the density drainage density so for permanent val data you can come to classify by re reclassify classify now here you impute your raster and come to classify and make it 10 class as usual yeah. so it will come down here okay okay then you we'll come down here to make it what drainage d and drainage t d drainage so 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 this is the classified uh Drainage, you can change the color um, and everything will be okay by that. So, this is how you perform a drainage density using focal statistics. So, stay tuned for a new tutorial. In the new tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a drainage density using drainage density to stay tuned subscribe for more update coming your way dick map solution